Hello guys and welcome to uh, Conspirator Brock's YouTube channel. Um, this is a different kind of video. Uh, it's an unboxing video of sort uh, because it's I'm opening a package. Um, <laughs> so during the uh, pandemic and the stay at home uh, orders, uh, I was online a lot more. And so I was, you know, exposed to a little bit more uh, things, specifically uh, Kickstarter stuff. Um, and so I backed a few Kickstarters, uh, last year, um, because I was, you know, um, just stuck at home and, and just online. So, uh, this is one of the first ones I backed. Um, it's, it's basically, um, uh, what's the best term is it? Um, it's from Magnetic Press, um, which, uh, they, I think most of what they do is they bring books from other countries over to America as Kickstarters. Um, so this one was called Aster of Pan, um, and it looks amazing. Um, the uh, Kickstarter had a, uh, basically you could get a hardcover version of it, and it had a variant cover which with a, a Peach Momoko cover, and um, it ended up having a ton of add-ons and, and, and um, what is it, uh, reward tiers and all that stuff. So uh, it's in this box right here this Astro Pan. So this, this arrived today. Uh, so Friday, the, um, the fifth, and, uh, I'm going to open it up and see, this is the first Kickstarter I've comic book I've backed and gotten back. Um, again, it's, uh, Astro Pan by, um, a creator called Merwan. Um, he's based in France. Uh, this was actually originally released in France, um, under, uh, the title Mechanique Celeste, which basically trans it translates in English to Celestial Mechanics. Um, so, uh, yeah, whether or not that's significant. Uh, it was released in France in September, on September 27th of 2019. Um, and the Kickstarter for this one specifically uh, finished up on September 17th of 2020. So almost an exact year later, the Kickstarter goes. Um, some of you may have noticed if your comic book store... Um, Orders stuff like this. Uh, Astro Pan came out this week uh, in comic book stores. They had the regular cover for it there. Um, we got it at Comics Conspiracy. I don't know if we still have a copy on the shelf, but uh, it's definitely something I'm excited to read and I'm excited to bust open and see what's in this bad boy. So let's get going. Um, I don't know. You know, Kickstarter is a fun, is a decent place for creative people to, you know, come and, and get their stuff, uh, you know, back so that they can actually make it. Um, I have backed a handful of more of these, so I'll probably be doing more of these opening videos. So, uh, the pretty cool thing is when you, when you originally open it up, it's kind of, uh, got stuff in the middle. Uh, they did include this, these pieces of cardboard here to keep everything from bouncing around as much. Uh, but there's a fair amount of stuff in here, so... Uh, let's get to it. I don't even know all of what the rewards tiers were, so this is all new to me. Um, and yeah, uh, first up we have an actual like stress ball, Aster Pan themed stress ball. So hey, I got another stress ball when the kids are. Urgh. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, we have, I think this was the last one to uh, come about rewards wise, and that was that's an Aster Pan. Pin, which they put in a nice little plastic pouch. Uh, that's pretty cool. Uh, <laughs> so I'll take it out and show you guys. So there's the Astra Pan uh, pin right there. Let's focus it a bit better. So yeah, that's pretty cool. It's very heavy. So it's not one of those small ones and it's got two uh, pin holes on it. So, and this is actually the, based on the art on the cover for the uh, one that comes out, that came out in comic book stores. Uh, in the United States. So I don't know what the French version looks like, but hey, what can you do? All right, so I got a stress ball and a, a pin. What else do we got? Well, it looks like we, ha we have a nice uh, Celestial Mechanics Club patch there. Let me go ahead and focus for you guys. So it's a nice patch to put on something if you're a huge fan. But yeah, there's a nice little patch there. Um, they did these things, um, which I think it's pretty cool, uh, and they have uh, these these little coins that they did. Uh, again, it comes in a nice little plastic uh, pouch. Uh, it's definitely, you know, 
heavy, but uh, here's the here's the coin on one side. It's a Celestial Mechanics, and then on the back side, it's got some of the uh, other stuff. So, uh, what it says on it is uh, "Last Envoy Standing Wins the War," and uh, "Your Passport to a World of Wonder" from Magnetic Press. So yeah, so it's pretty hefty. Oh. And of course I drop it and it goes all the way over there, but that's okay. Pick it up later. Or my kids will scramble to get it because that's what they do. Come on. Anyway, all right. So let's put that back in the pouch. Oh, it's a slip pouch too. Interesting. All right, get that in. All right, I got it. Uh, next up we have a, it looks like um, a production sketchbook. So they included a production sketchbook. So this is the Peach Mocha cover there. And it looks like it's on the other side. We have some of Merwin's stuff. Uh, if I go ahead. Yeah, so the Merwin is the front one and the Peach Mocha is the back upside down cover. But yeah, it's definitely a nice little sketchbook for all the Astro Pan stuff. So yeah, so that's, that's definitely pretty cool. So nice stock stocky heavy paper uh it included a small little um print so pan of course there and what else do we have we have uh they actually included a bigger print and so there is another print that goes along with it so yeah i'm probably gonna have to get some protective sleeves for these things um but yeah so far we have you know four, five, six, seven items, and I haven't even gotten to the actual book itself, um, which is coming up right now. And so mine looks like it came in fairly good condition, but this is the Aster of Pan um, hardcover. This was about, I got it on an early bird, so it was about 30 uh, bucks for all of this. Um, they give it a packing list down on the bottom here with a note that says, thank you for, you know, so on and so forth. Uh, but yeah, so there is this. It's hefty. I, it feels really good. Man, this, it looks amazing. I'm actually really excited to check this out. Woof, that fresh, fresh printed smell. Ah, but yeah, so there is the, the Peach Momoko cover for Aster of Pan. This is the first Kickstarter I've gotten. It looks pretty cool. So yeah, I cannot wait to pop this, uh, to oh, read this. Uh, it's technically considered a YA novel or graphic novel, so it's good for, you know, teens and stuff. So, yeah, but uh, definitely, definitely super excited to dive into Astro of Pan. Um, they did a nice little like, shiny thing with the lettering there. And then if you want to check out the spine, that looks nice. And then, of course, the back. In the back, that was the print image that we got. So, yeah, so that's that. Pretty cool. Um, yeah, I am happy with it. It is big. Um, it's a little wider than the normal trade paperback. I would equate this to probably almost the same width as uh, the magazine size uh, black label um, collections that come out. Let's see, can I grab one easy to compare? Sure. Uh, let's not do that one. Let's do this one. Okay. Yeah, so this is the Astro Pan and this is the Har Harleen black label so if i put them together the astra pan covers pretty much covers up the harley or harleen and the harleen covers up the astra pan so it's basically the size of the black label hard covers so yeah but that's super cool like i'm super super stoked both covers are actually amazing um part of me is tempted to actually snag the regular cover as well because i'm a weirdo and i have to have tons of stuff but hey um, so yeah, this is Aster of Pan by Mer Merwin uh, from Magnetic Press, uh, and it was on Kickstarter. So uh, thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Um, if you've ever picked up a Kickstarter, if you gravitate towards more single issue gra uh, Kickstarters or graphic novels Kickstarters, art, whatever. Let you know. Let, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Um, you can listen to me on the Comics Conspiracy podcast. Um, we actually just finished recording um, an episode with Joshua Williamson, so check that out. Um, there'll be a link in the description below for that specific episode. 
And uh, yeah, but uh, Aster of Pan from Kickstarter by Merwin. This is so nice. It's awesome. I cannot wait to start getting these. Um, I have a couple more coming in. Um, the But uh, yeah, super, super excited. Um, I would tell you to follow me on Twitter, but right now I'm still suspended. So uh, yeah, and uh, as usual, I'll see you next time.